Well guys, here I have ZT Axon, first one, and it has Google Log here. So, what you will need to do to achieve the Google Log Bypass, you need to set up Wi-Fi connection. Here I will show you what is locked. Now it says the device was reset to continue signing with a Google account what was previously synced on this device. You see that, right? So, you know the issue. Wi-Fi is on. Here on the top you see Wi-Fi. We go back. So we do with two fingers, we press and keep. Continue touching the screen until you hear a beep to enable accessibility mode. Accessibility mode enabled. Accessibility okay. tutorial. So when we'll explore, exit. exit button. Exit button. Welcome. Now we will try to use a gesture. Something like that. Emergency call button. Overview. Accessibility tutorial. Accessibility tutorial. Okay, this is what we need. This gesture is like L letter, but you draw it from the left to the from the right to left and top. You seen that? And uh, in my case, I it didn't work from the first time and I tried a lot so you see you will need to do the same. Now we will go to search. Here this is the search so we will use it for everything what we need here. First we need to to Google not back voice search Google app. I press here no thanks. No thank Google. Open keyboard edit box searcher say hot word. So here on the top I will type S settings. E T you can see settings here. Settings. And we will settings. Mobile networks. To scroll up and down you use two fingers, you put on the screen and you scroll. App. Here we go in accessibility. Accounts. No. Add account. No, 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 no. Settings. So you touch one. Accessibility. And press twice. Accessibility. That thing. Talk back. Talk back. Which one? On off. switch. Alert stop talk. Back. OK button. Yes, you feel the, the relief, right? So next we go to Chrome. OK. So we go in back. There is a one dot and you use it as a go back. So we use Chrome. And we do accept and continue. We do next. We do no thanks. So now we need the root junkie. We will use the root junkie application and I will show you how you can load on a computer. It's the website's called Wikisend. Here you have upload. I will put this file to the description so you can get it. Like that. We do properties. Here we have friendly file name. Let's type something like root123. Lifetime seven days description we don't need want to receive results link by email not protect by email uh, protect with a password no what we have here is options scroll we press upload file and it's uploading Uh, 
Okay, so this is the link, and we need to use it on our phone. So it will be in your case, it will be the link will be different, but the principle will be the same. So we need colon. So to remind you, I will put the true John KPK in the description. You will upload yourself to Wikisend, and after that, once you upload it, you can get the file from the phone. Let's try this, My, I assume it's gonna work, let's see if it works. Okay, yeah, so you just type the number as I did and it will... Here you have download file, we just do download. Says here, okay. Downloading. Now we need to go to settings, so I press on this button here. We need to go to settings, right? So here on the top I do settings. And we need to turn on the security. Security here. We do unknown sources, okay. Now we go back again here. Again. And we type here on the top downloads. Down. Actually, you see it's here. So, you have here root junkie. You do that. You do install. You do accept. Now it's asking us to open and it will provide us the link here. We press in three dots here on the top right. Browser sign in. So you do OK. I will type my spam email. And you need to use, of course, kind of Google account what you have. So you do that. I will type the password. Okay. Now we do go back, we do settings here, we go to accounts and we remove that account, account, Google, three dots here, not, so you choose account, you do three dots here, remove account, remove account. Now we go back. We will try to do backup and reset. Okay. Okay. So this phone doesn't want to do reset for some known reason. But what we can do, we do turn off. So I can, as you remember, we remove the account. 
I do turn off, I do restart. So we do next, skip. Now, as you remember, before the prompt was different. Now, just say sign in to get the most out of your device or create a new account. So, we do skip, skip, next, skip, skip anyway, more, next, next, and that's it. So let's see what kind of version it has here about the phone, what it says here, model number A1R, R, Android version 5.1.1, what else we can see here, nothing else. So this is it, uh, pre please uh, press on like button if you like this video and share with your friends. Thank you very much for watching.